players in 2D platformers are mostly limited to horizontal movements. And in most cases, the only vertical movement you have is a jump. But what do you do when there are platforms that cannot be reached with a jump? For example, do you see the key on the upper platform? The player has no chance of getting it, right? We could easily implement a double jump or simply increase the jump height, but sometimes you want to introduce new elements to your game. And just like that, boom, ladder. So what I have here is a ladder with a box collider 2D that is set to trigger and a movable player that looks like the tip of a penis with eyes and feet. <laughs> penis. In order for the player to climb the ladder, we need to write some code. Let's add a script called ladder movement to our player and open it up. First, we need a couple of private variables. A float for our vertical input as we are currently only able to move horizontally, a float for the speed, a boolean that tells us if we are standing next to a ladder, and the boolean that indicates whether we are already climbing or not. Last but not least, we need a serialized field to reference our player's rigid body 2D. To check if our player is standing next to a ladder, we use the onTrigger Enter 2D and onTrigger Exit 2D methods. Inside, we then want to see if the tag of our collided object is ladder. We're going to add the tag later in Unity. So we set the variable is ladder to true when we enter the ladder's trigger and to false when we exit the ladder's trigger. We also want to set is climbing to false when we exit the ladder's trigger. In the update method, we want to parse the return value of input.getAxis vertical into our vertical variable. This returns a value between minus 1 and 1, depending on which button is pressed. By default, the vertical input is set to the W and S or the up and down key on your keyboard. So, if is letter is true and the absolute value of our vertical input is greater than 0, we set is climbing to true as well. The next step would be to disable gravity and move our player. As we are working with physics here, we do that in the fixed update method. So if this climbing is true, we set the rigid body's gravity scale to zero. Afterwards, we set the rigid body's velocity to our vertical value multiplied by our speed while leaving the horizontal value as it is. And if this climbing is not true, we set the gravity back to our normal value. In my case, that's 4. That's everything we have to do in our script. Let's go back to Unity. We're almost done, but there are still two more things we need to do. First, drag the player's rigid body onto the rigid body reference in our script. And second, select the letter game object, add a new tag called letter and assign it afterwards. If we hit play now, we should be able to climb the ladder. This is one of probably thousands of ways to make letters in Unity, but maybe this one is the right way for you. If that's the case, please leave a like and consider subscribing, and if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.